the extreme light infrastructure nuclear physics or ELIMP would be the most advanced centers in laser and gamma physics. Extreme light infrastructure nuclear physics uh, is a new research center uh, under construction. Its value is more than 300 million euros and will be operational in 2019. It's based on two big machines, two systems, with uh, parameters uh, far beyond uh, any existing ones in the world. High power laser system, 20 petawatt lasers, a gamma beam system, high brilliance, very good bandwidth with, with variable energy. It's a natural development of this place, which is the birthplace of physics in Romania six years ago, where we started the National Nuclear Program. We have expertise in both laser physics, uh, we're the fourth laser in the world built in, in Magurele. So we have four accelerators, we have a very good expertise in nuclear physics. Our mission here is to design and build experimental setups for the first nuclear physics experiments with the 10 petawatt lasers. This is a grand challenge because nobody ever did experiments at 10 petawatt and because the interaction of the 10 petawatt lasers with matter is not yet known. In this room, we will accelerate near solid density ion beams to giga electron volt energies and then use these beams to produce on Earth nuclear reactions which can happen only in stars. In another part of the building, we will accelerate GeV electrons to very high ultra-relativistic energies and we will collide the electrons with 10 petawatt lasers to study extreme regimes in quantum electrodynamics. All these experiments will require developing new instruments and measurement techniques, which is both very challenging and very interesting. The research uh, will be focused on using these two systems with each of them or combined experiment in four big categories. Uh, the nuclear physics with uh, uh, high power lasers will use uh, uh, nuclear physics tools and methods to characterize the interaction of a uh, uh, high intensity laser beam with matter photonuclear reactions for, uh, to excite uh, dipole states in, uh, in nuclei to produce photofission, to look into fine structure of uh, giant dipole resonance or to study exotic reaction in astrophysics to determine the cross-sections of various reactions. Uh, we'll be also experimenting in quantum electrodynamics, last but probably not least, uh, apply the research with various applications. We are in the continuous process of hiring people. The jobs are open for competition in the, the entire world. We have already researchers and uh, engineers and technicians from more than 20 countries. It is likely also that new discoveries will be made here. Being here from the beginning gives the opportunity to shape the future of the project and to implement novel ideas on a large scale. There are so many new things to be explored. For young people coming here, I would mention that Romania is a country with a relatively low cost of living, while the salary is at ILINP at the European level. We will try to do experiments in conditions similar to the ones occurring in very extreme astrophysical environments, in large stars and also in supernova explosions. It's a great opportunity it will not be easy because it's challenging, it's hard to, to build this infrastructure and it will also be hard to, to keep it working at the best parameters and do experiments that were never done before. If you're good and you like challenges, come to LIMP and uh, it's going to be great. As an engineer, my working group here at ELI-NP is the control system for the gamma beam system. I also conduct research on beam physics for the linear accelerator for the gamma beam system. As a project in the implementation phase, ELI-NP has a young and international team. Ideas from young engineers and research scientists are highly respected. Young people are warmly encouraged to participate in international conferences and workshops and to build collaboration relationship with other institutes in other countries. LINP aims to bring two research communities together, the nuclear physicists and the laser physicists, and this is very unique uh, in the world of research. For me, as an engineer, the best thing 
about working at ILINP is to have technical and management tasks in a multidisciplinary environment. So I did not want to work and do the same thing over again and again, and there is no chance of that happening here. If you are considering joining ELIMP, you will have the chance to work on resolving challenging issues at the forefront of technological advancement. You will be well welcomed and find a culture that fosters uh, initiative, creativity, and much as much as teamwork. ELIMP will be the starting point of a new direction in physics.